Hello, welcome to the Mad Batter channel. My name's Chris. If you find this video interesting and or useful, perhaps you'll consider giving it a like and possibly subscribing to the channel, which would be a great help. Many thanks. In this video, I'm going to show you how to effectively get back the old strength or opacity slider for a preset applied to an image so you can reduce its effect below 100% or indeed increase it above 100%. So here we have a landscape image. I've done some very basic editing to get the light better. Now we're going to presets. And if you apply the preset, after you've done it, there used to be a slider down here where you could change the strength of that preset. But that slider seems to have disappeared in recent updates to Luminar Neo. So I'm going to show you how to get it back and the trick is to apply the preset to your image and export it as a new image. It's all a bit of a faff, but it's the best we can do. So I'm going to apply the Dream Film preset and then we can export it as a separate image, give it a name and all the rest of it and click export. Now I've already done that, so I won't do it again and I'll just revert this image back to its original state. So now we'll take the original image into the edit panel and we're going to add a layer. Now what we need to add is that image with the preset applied to it. So first of all we need to find it. So we're going to images and there's the image with the preset applied. Then we'll double click on it and it comes in by default at 50%. So now we have a preset version of the image and if I hide it for a minute we've got the original underneath so we'll show it again. And now of course we can change the opacity of this top layer. If it's down to zero effectively we have none of the preset. If it's at 100 we have it applied at 100% strength and obviously we can go anywhere in between. So if we're at 50 odd percent, hide it, you can see that it has been applied partially. And what if we want to increase the strength of the preset above 100 percent? Well now what you need to do is to start with the exported image with the preset applied once and go in and apply the preset again. So now we have it applied at 200% effectively. And if we go into edit and load the original image as a new layer, increase the strength to 100% and move it underneath, make sure we're working on the top layer. So this is the image with 200% applied and we can reduce it. So if we reduce it down to 50, that's with the preset applied at 100% and that's obviously at zero. So now you can go from zero to 200%. So that's how you get effectively get the opacity slider for presets back. So you can vary the preset between 0 and 100 and between 100 and 200%. I agree it's a bit of a faff and hopefully Skylum will restore the slider soon. In the meantime, I hope you found this useful and many thanks for watching.